What's going on, Muck Jobs? We're back in Detroit today. Where we left off, uh, Marcus made it to Jericho. Um, Kara got away from Connor. And now, we have to go see Amanda. I think we're going to be in trouble or something. I don't know. But, let's hop right in. I'm loving this game so much, dude. You guys seem to be liking it, too. So, that makes me happy. Um, yeah, I, I, I saw a few comments that were saying um, <clears throat> that Hello, they needed part two and stuff, so Hi. tried I've been trying to get it out you. as fast as I can. Would you mind a little walk? Uh oh. Do I actually have to walk, or is it gonna be okay? Just gotta watch. That deviant seemed to be an intriguing case. Pity you didn't manage to capture it. Oh, fuck. Pragmatic. I agree. I may not be suited for this investigation. Oh. Maybe you should consider replacing me. Did you manage to learn anything? I don't know. Oh. <clears throat> uh, oh, there's a locked one. I found its diary. But it was encrypted. It may take weeks to decipher. Okay. What else? The sign on the walls. The walls of the apartment were covered with drawings of labyrinths and other symbols. Oh, like right, the other right, right, deviants, right, right. it seemed obsessed with R and I. You came very close to capturing that deviant. How is your relationship with the lieutenant developing? Saving he Hank. seemed grateful that I saved his life on the roof. He didn't say anything, but he expressed it in his own way. Yeah, we. I love Hank, dude. I don't want Hank to die. We don't uh -oh. have much time. Deviancy continues to spread. It's only a matter of time before the media finds out about it. Is she mad that we I saved Hank? This. Whatever it takes. I will solve this investigation, Amanda. I won't disappoint you. A new case just came in. Find Anderson and investigate it. Ooh, she's mad. She's mad. She's mad. That's okay. I don't really care. Like, Amanda seems like kind of a dick. I love Connor. Thanks, our friend. Yes. That's awesome. Lieutenant Anderson. Anybody Ooh. home? Find a way inside. <laughs> Wait. Let me just ring it one more time. Okay, I didn't, okay. <laughs> I didn't know he's just gonna sit on it like that. All right, that might be taken the wrong way. Okay, <laughs> I didn't know he was just gonna leave it on like that. Whoa. Come on, Connor, you can hop the fence. You could do that. Come on. Come on. Come on, come on, come on. Come on, come on, come on, come on. Oh. oh, doggy. There's a little doggy in there. Well, Anderson, if you're not going to let me in, I'm going to let myself in. Hank's cool though. I'm glad. Uh, I'm glad he could. Uh... <gasps> oh my God! Lieutenant Anderson. Oh, 
Get in there, Connor. <laughs> Easy, dog. I'm, I'm huh. not gonna hurt you. <laughs> I'm here to save your owner. Aww. Good doggy. Hank! Jesus! You okay? <laughs> yeah, makes sense. <laughs> Did he throw up? Oh. Slight arrhythmia? No signs of trouble. Yep. <gasps> Was he gonna kill himself? Lieutenant. <laughs> Wake up, Lieutenant. It's oh my God. Connor. <laughs> I'm going to sober you up for your own hey, safety. Hey, you have to warn me. Leave me alone, this may be you fucking android. Get the fuck out of my house. I'm sorry, Lieutenant, but I need you. <laughs> Thank you in advance for your cooperation. We get the fuck out of here. <laughs> Hank, hey. you are so drunk, dude. Shimo, <laughs> attack! <laughs> good dog. Attack! <laughs> He's a good dog. Oh fuck! I think I'm gonna be <laughs> sick. All right. Well, <laughs> we're here to help you, Hank. <laughs> Ah, oh, leave me alone, you asshole. I'm not going anywhere. <laughs> yes, you are. <laughs> oh, my God. What the hell are you doing? <sighs> oh, no. I don't want a bath. Thank you. Sorry, Lieutenant. It's for your own good. <laughs> Just going to turn it on? <laughs> <laughs> what the fuck are you doing here? A homicide was reported 43 minutes ago. I couldn't find you at Jimmy's bar, so I came to see if you were at home. <laughs> oh, that's great. Jesus, I must be the only cop in the world that gets assaulted in his own house by his own fucking android. <laughs> oh my god, I love it. Can't you just leave me alone? No. Unfortunately, I cannot. I've been programmed to investigate this case, and I can't do it without you. <laughs> I don't give a shit about your goddamn case. Lieutenant, you're not yourself. You should beat it, you hear me? Get the hell out of here. Hank, relax, buddy. We're here to help you. I understand. It probably wasn't interesting anyway. <laughs> man found dead in a sex club downtown. Guess they'll have to solve the case without us. <laughs> you know, probably wouldn't do me any harm to get some air. <laughs> There's some clothes in the bedroom there. I'll go get them. <laughs> oh my god. Hank just wants to go to the club. <laughs> Wait, I wonder if I can go pet the dog. Can I go pet the dog? Pet the dog. Where's the dog? Doggy? Doggy! Yes, hello, doggy. Oh, yes, he's so cute. Very, very still, though. Oh! He is breathing. Okay. Good. <clears throat> Alright. Hank, I'll get you clothes. Get you some clothes, buddy. So we can go to the club. We're just getting... We're just getting Hank some clothes because we want to go to the club. What we're do you want to wear? We're going to go clubbing. <laughs> Hippie. <laughs> Hippie. <laughs> He's going to be bad. Is Hank a hippie? Are you all right, Lieutenant? 
Yeah, yeah. <sighs> Wonderful. Just uh, give me five minutes, okay? Sure. Oh, man. Learn more about me. Ooh, what can I go touch? What can I go put my little fingies on? Alright, I'm not like too worried. I'm just gonna cycle through it so you guys can read it if you want. And then, uh. Oh! Hank, what are you reading? Don't be reading that. Being devious. Hank! Okay. Let's go out here. Let's see what we can put our little digits on. Okay. I would like to look at this. Say nothing. I'll say nothing. Respect. Truck. How long has this been here? <gasps> Hank has a son. Ah, oh, shit. That's sad. That's upsetting. Oh, I didn't get to look at everything else. Be a good dog, Sumo. Sumo! Why are you looking at me like that, Hank? Ah, oh, I didn't get to look at everything. That's one thing I don't like. Is the, uh... Like, I, I can't look at everything, sadly. I would like to, but I cannot. Are we going back to Jericho? Jericho, 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 Jericho. Oh, yeah, because we were, uh, we're going to steal a bunch of uh, uh, Android parts, right? Crazy. If they catch us, we're dead. What do we do now? We need to find the Cyberlife warehouse. That's where they keep the spare parts and the blue blood. The blue blood. Oh, uh, go. Go, go, go. Where'd she go? Don't let them see us. I'm just running. I can't really see. <laughs> I'm just running. <laughs> We're not being very discreet. Oh, Kara just or that's not Kara. She just appeared. Now what do do? I'll find another way. Why don't you guys climb? There you go. Now you're thinking with your dipstick. I still want to know like how heavy androids are. Doing this shit, Assassin's Creed style. Side below. It's right there. Sweet. Yo. Yeah. Dang. I'm coming. Oh, that's crazy. Yeah, cause I mean they can hold on for as long as they need to, cause they can't get like tired essentially.
The warehouse is up ahead. We're almost there. Oh my god! That was a lot more fluid than what I did. <laughs> Cyberlife warehouses. We have everything we're looking for. First, we have to get rid of that drone. Bunch of delinquent kids. Leave it to me. We can just jump onto the drone. Oh, shit. <laughs> okay, let's see what happens here. Would be spotted. Okay. Yeah, I, I figured that would be the... I feel like this is going to be the one. Well, maybe... Maybe not. Okay. Alright. But how are you gonna destroy it? Like, oh, oh, oh! I didn't know I was gonna have to mash the buttons. Ah, I'm doing it. You okay? Yeah, yeah, I'm fine. Good job, Marcus. Let's do it, dudes. Quick, open the other crates and fill your bags. Take as much as you can. Uh. Okay. Um. Oh. Okay. Get the stuff. Get the stuff. Get the blood. Get the blood. You were trespassing on private property. Your presence constitutes a level two infraction. I will notify security. John! God damn machine! Where is it this time? Oh, I got a pick. John! I need your help. John! Shit. I don't know if I made the right choice. I don't know what Norse is gonna do. Now this. Just okay. my luck. Let's finish up and get out of here. Yeah. Okay. Find some blue blood. Don't really want to have enough. There's more. It's right there. Okay. <laughs> Um, I don't, yeah, I don't really want to kill him, because it's kind of messed up. I mean, he's a fully working android. The bigger crate? Where's the bigger crate? That crate? It's probably a whole fucking android. Also, that's pretty easy for, like, to open. For such a big, uh, for such a technology based company. Wow. Yep. Why aren't you like us? Don't you want to be free? Free You could join us. I feel like that was a bad decision. Um, we should probably get the hell out of here. <laughs> Respected. Cool. That's all we can carry. Let's go. I feel like that's going to be a bad decision if they follow us. Take me with you. He 
he's on their side, we can't trust him. He took a risk for us. We can't just leave him here. We can't bring them back with us. It's too dangerous. Refuse. Yeah. I'm sorry. You can't come with us. I helped you. It's not fair. I helped you and now you're just gonna leave without me? You're no better than humans. You're no better than humans. He triggered the alarm. Run! Fuck. I figured that was gonna happen. Over the fence, quick! I didn't know what else to do. Like, he can't just come with us. Ooh. This is to the police. Stay where you are. Damn, dude. We have blue blood and bio components. There will be enough for everyone. We couldn't have done it without Marcus. We're going to become the Jericho God. <laughs> I came to Jericho because here androids are free. Free to live in the dark, hoping that no one finds us. Free to die in silence, waiting for a change that's never gonna come. Hmm. But I don't want that freedom. And I'm not gonna beg for the right to smile, or love, or stand tall. I don't know about you, but there's something inside me that knows but I'm feeling that I am more than what they say. I am alive, and they're not going to take that from me anymore. Damn. Pep talk. Our days of slavery are over. What humans don't want to hear, we will tell them. What they don't want to give, we take. We are people. We are alive. We are free. Yeah! Uh, you guys should probably pull out your little chip things in your head there. He's bringing change to Jericho. <laughs> That's awesome. Oh, I got a got an achievement. Jericho's hero. Marcus got enough parts. Oh, that could have gone bad. What? No way. Oh. That could have gone south in so many ways. Only 28% got the got all of the stuff. Oh boy. <sighs> Hank. Hank, Hank, Hank. Oh, we're driving. Yeah, I guess Oh, feels like somebody's playing with a drill inside my skull. You sure this is the place? It's the address in the report. Right. <laughs> okay. Hank, we all know you want to be Let's there. Let's get going. Jesus. Oh, he's got a hula girl. <laughs> I want to get a hula girl for my uh, my vehicle. That'd be funny. Come on, Hank. Sexiest androids in town. Now I know why you insisted on coming here. <laughs> no. Oh, boy. Oh, man. I hope I don't have to blur anything. Welcome to Eden Club. Oh, my. Whoa, whoa. I mean, to... can you actually, like, is there anything? Like, can you go up and, like, oh, you can. You can. Okay. Yeah, I thought. Okay. Well, we got the. Yeah. You're not gonna we saw him. Oh my. Okay. I just don't want to have to blur anything. <laughs> that room there. Oh, uh, by He's the way, the robot. Gavin's there the, too. Like, oh yeah. great. Dead body and an asshole. Just what I needed. Huh. Connor, the fuck are you doing? Coming, Lieutenant. 
Sorry. I didn't realize. I didn't realize he was. He wanted me to be anywhere. Lieutenant Anderson is plastic hell. The fuck are you two doing here? We've been assigned all cases involving androids. Hmm? Oh yeah. Only well, wasting your time. There's some pervert who uh <laughs> got more action than he could handle. <laughs> we'll have a look huh. anyway, if you don't mind. <laughs> Come on, let's go. What it's, a prick. Uh, starting to stink of booze in here. Night, Lieutenant. What an asshole. What the fuck was that for? Okay. Um Let's look at whatever else we can in the room first. Oh no, what all this stuff is. Obviously that's the dude's wallet, I think. Let's check the android. I guess. Uh diagnose. Critically damaged by a component. Critically damaged, okay. Oh, hey, hey, hey! Oh, Connor, you're so disgusting. <laughs> God! I think I'm gonna puke again. <laughs> oh, man. Okay. Okay, now let's examine this dude. Okay, do not take the blanket off him. No sign of cardiac event. Wait, uh, heart attack, not cause of death. Okay. Signs of strangulation. Whoa, asphyxiation. Oh my god, so did did she go crazy? Yeah. Yep. Ah. She went, uh... She went deviant. I don't know if... Do you say she went deviant? Or, like, she is a deviant. She became deviant. Or whatever. And then, uh... Killed herself, must be? Yeah. Yep. Yeah, she strangled him. He didn't die of a heart attack. He was strangled. Yeah, I saw the bruising on the neck. Doesn't prove anything, though. Could have been rough play. We're missing something here. Yeah. Think you can read the android's memory? Maybe you can see what happened. See if we can. I can try. Whoa, connect? Oh. Reactivation required. The only way to access its memory is to reactivate it. Think you can do it? It's badly Whoa. damaged. If I can, it'll only be for a minute, maybe less. I just hope it's long enough to learn something. <laughs> oh shit. Time before shutdown. Is to know what happened. Is he? Is he dead? Yes, he is. Tell me what happened. He started hitting me. Oh shit! Again and again. I begged him to stop. Yeah, I'm not gonna say that. It was like he was I'm enjoying time it. Right now. Did you kill him? No. No, it wasn't me. What else do you remember? Hurry, we don't have much time. I, 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 I don't know. I, I don't. I, I don't know. Were you I alone in the room? Was there anyone else with you? He wanted us to play with two girls. That's what he said. There was two of us. Uh. What model was the other android? Did it look like you? Uh oh, we're running out of time. Fuck! Damn it! Okay, well. Damn it. So there was another android. This happened over an hour ago. It's probably long gone. No. It couldn't go outside dressed like that unnoticed. It might still be here. It's gotta be. If you could find a deviant among all the other androids in this place. Yeah. Deviants aren't easily detected. Oh, shit. It's gotta be some other way. Maybe an eyewitness. Somebody who saw it leaving the room. No security cameras at all. 
few questions about what he saw. You let me know if you think of anything. Did you know the victim? No, I mean, he came in maybe two, three times. I mean, these guys, they don't really talk very much, you know? They come in, do their business, and then go on their way. You really been in trouble with androids before? No way! Oh, really? Okay. Uh, maybe I can talk to this girl. Just banished me or find out what happened. Uh, I don't know, like, what else I can do here. Probably don't have any CCTV. <laughs> hey, Hank. Excuse me, Lieutenant. Can you come here a second? Found something? Maybe. Can you rent this, Tracy? For fuck's sake, Connor, we got better things to do. <laughs> Please, Lieutenant. Just trust me. D just tell him what your plan is. <laughs> 30 bucks? What the fuck? Jesus. Hello. A 30 minute session costs $29.99. Oh my Please god. Confirm your purchase. Hello, Lieutenant. 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 But that's okay. Uh oh. Delighted to meet you. Follow me. I'll take you to your room. Okay, now what? <laughs> I guess we just follow her. This is gonna be weird. Oh shit. What the hell are you doing? Okay. Oh. Right there. Blue haired. A blue haired Tracy headed toward the entrance. Okay. Okay. Oh, oh, check the next android. Okay. It saw something. What are you talking about? I saw what? The deviant leave the room. A blue haired Tracy. Club policy is to wipe the android's memory every two hours. We only have a few minutes if we want to find another witness. S position. Right here. Uh. Uh. I don't know. I don't know. I don't know. This one. Hey, this one right here. To do with Let's try this one. This better be. Oh my god, we are we are the stripper. Are they technically a stripper or turned back into the club. Okay. It saw the blue-haired Tracy. I know so which way it went. This they dude's go gonna for know. it. There are androids everywhere. How are you gonna tell which one saw the Tracy with blue hair? I know which direction it took. I just need to find it. Android. Okay. Spin! Oh! Hello! Into the red room. Okay. We gotta go into the red room. Go! Dude in the middle, right? That's who's gonna know, right? I mean, they're kind of spinning around. They kind of know what's going on, right? Whoa! God damn! Shit! It didn't. I didn't see anything. I made a mistake somewhere. This has got to be the most expensive investigation of my career. Huh. Come on, Hank. Fuck. Where are you? Blue haired Tracy didn't come. How much time do we have left? Okay, it's five minutes. Okay. It's a decent bit of time. You. Whoa. 
Not at all. Okay. You didn't see anything. You. I made a mistake somewhere. <laughs> this is gonna be the most. Oh, there she is. There she is. Turn to the blue room. Okay. Blue room. Go, go, go. <laughs> Got her. Go. Run. Uh, I don't know which one. Okay, just first one. First one. Dang, Hank. Renting all the... All the, uh... All the, uh... Android women. I love the music. Oh, this is cool. Left the room. Ah, damn it! Oh, this is so tense. How much time? Ah, <laughs> I love how Hank is just buying it. all of this. Uh oh. Oh, okay. I don't. I don't like nothing. Blue-haired Tracy didn't come this way. There she is. There she is. What the staff room? Okay. Staff room! I know where it went. Follow me. Oh, fucking A. This is crazy. Well, you know what, Hank? You're crazy sometimes. You know that? Wait. I'll take it from here. Thanks, Hank. Oh man, this is tense. Ooh. Also, we haven't touched on uh, Kara. <laughs> I guess touched is kind of a bad word currently. Um, shit, we're too late. No, we're not. No, we're not. Blood? Christ, look at them. They get used till they break and then they get tossed out. Okay, WR 400. Oh! Blue hair. I see your blue hair. In the case? guys can read this. I'm going to take way too long because I'm illiterate, so if you guys would like to read it, you can. Back to the investigation! Where did I have to go? Oh, I was going to go this way. Oh, there's a fucking wide open door. I didn't even realize that. Damn it. RA9. Damn, dude. People are fucking insane. They don't want relationships anymore. Everybody just gets an android. They cook Aww. what you want. They screw when you want. And you don't have to worry about how they feel. Next thing I'm you sorry, know, Hank. we're going to be extinct because everybody would rather buy a piece of plastic than to love another human being. Oh. Beats me. Maybe they didn't run. Maybe they're not far. Okay, I don't know what to do now. Oh. Oh. Hello, Miss Tracy. <coughs> Oh, there's two! Oh, shit! Oh, shit! Don't move! Uh, hey! 
Frank! No! Ah! I hit all the wrong buttons. Come on, Connor. She's in fucking heels. Oh my god. Ah! Oh my god! She's got a screwdriver! Shit, wrong button! I'm hitting all the wrong buttons! Jesus Christ! Oh my god! Hank! Oh my god, dude! Save Hank! Save Hank! Save Hank! Uh, uh... Pull! Yes! Throw her! Android fight. This is crazy. Oh my god. They're on the move. Quick, they're getting away. Shit, I hit the wrong button. Okay. All the right buttons. All the right buttons. I'm gonna hit all the right buttons from now on. S. D. 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 Come on, Connor. No oh, shit. Wrong button. Damn it. But I didn't even, I didn't even notice. Shoot. Damn. Well, guess you should have thought about that. Guess you should have thought about that. Damn! Connor's ruthless! Let's go, baby! Why? I wonder how many people did that. Why did you kill her? Well, she was gonna kill me, motherfucker. She had nothing to do with any of this. Well... You were fucking trying to kill me. Well, not me, but Connor. And Hank. When that man killed that Tracy, I knew I was next. Oh, damn. I was so scared. I begged him to stop, but he wouldn't. So I put my hands around his throat and I squeezed. Oh my god. Until he stopped moving. Yes, I killed him. But I was just defending myself. Understandable. I wanted to live. I wanted to get back to the one I love. Forget about the humans, the smell of their sweat, and their dirty words. But you've... you've taken her away from me. Well... I love her. Damn, dude. I loved her. Oh, shit! Was that the right choice? The Tracys were killed. Damn, dude. Fuck! I didn't want them to die. Damn it! I didn't want them both to die. Oh! I forgot about that whole situation. Jesus. Luther! Alice, oh. and Kara. Whoa, autonomous. Hello. Turn up. The AX-400 android reported to have attacked its owner in the Detroit suburb. The Arctic conflict has escalated to new heights this morning. Mm. We have just. 
Detroit's heavy snowfall is expected to continue throughout the night. Meanwhile, fire crews have been battling a house fire on the outskirts of the city. Okay, next time there's an option to turn something like that on, I'm not going to hit it. I've never seen snow before. It's pretty. It's slowing us down. But at least we won't meet any humans along the way. Alice. You okay, Alice? We need. We need, girly. Hmm? It's a good thing Zlatko had a car. I wouldn't want Alice out walking in this cold. I saw it once in the garage. I don't know if Zako even ever used it. Huh. Malfunction detected. Emergency brakes activated. Uh, see, this is the problem. This is the problem with with uh, with future cars. This right here. This doesn't look good. Stay inside, Alice. Are we like an automatic master mechanic as well? I guess we should be, right? What are we going to do? I don't know. Because it shouldn't have an Continue engine. foot, right? I guess. It's 30 degrees. Alice won't make it. We have to find somewhere to spend the night. Then know where we can stay around here, Cap. What's over here? Find shelter. Yeah. There's gotta be something over here, right? Yeah! We can stay there. Fuck it. Over there. Amusement park. Also, if you guys hear my dog snoring, I'm sorry. <laughs> Pirates Cove. That's scary. Looks cool though. We need to find shelter. Season. We have to get out of the cold. Looks like it's been abandoned for a while. find something, right? Find anything? No. No place we could spend the night. There looks like maybe a good spot. Anything over here? We're gonna have to start a fire. what I was thinking. Whoa. Luther, get your big chesticles out of my face. Beware! Danger always comes when least expected. Oh, that's not a good thing to hear. Okay. Find shelter. What's this? Yes. Perfect. You need fire. Fire, 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 fire. Yes. Enter. I'll handle this. Yeah! Dude, Luther is fucking huge. 
Damn! Okay, we're gonna need that stuff though. Because we're gonna need uh, to create fire. Damn! I'm glad we have Luther on our side. Here we go! Well, there's a fireplace. I'll get a fire going. Yes! Good deal. Thanks, Luther. Three. Oh, what the? Why is this here? USS Iowa missing. Okay. I feel so bad for Alice, though. Like. She did not deserve any of this, man. I think there was a uh, there's a comment that said uh, said they felt bad. Uh, somebody said that they felt bad for Alice as well. <clears throat> Offer cookie. There are some cookies left. Would you like some? No, I'm not hungry. Check gun. Unlocked. What just unlocked? Hmm. Okay. That was odd. Oh. That's a little odd. I think maybe somebody's here. Poor Alice, dude. She's gonna sleep on the floor again. Alice? Oh man, I feel so bad for her. Uh. Was there something else over here? Skelly bones. Okay, let's just go talk to Alice now. Hi, Alice. Ugh. The shitty thing is... Uh, oh. <laughs> Do you think we'll be like them someday? Once we cross the border, we can start over. You can go to school. And maybe I'll find a job. We'll be like them. Like everyone else. <laughs> as long as we're together, that's all that matters. Dude, this whole story between Kara and Let's Alice you, is bud. gonna make me fucking cry, dude. Holy shit. It is so sad. Kiss your good thing. Sleep tight, Alice. Sweet dreams. Can you tell me a story, Kara? I have 9,000 children's stories in memory. <laughs> I should have Damn. for you. <laughs> 9,000? A knight. This is a story about a knight who... No. Not a story like that. Make one up for me. Ooh. Okay. This is a story about a little girl. Hmm. Unhappy.
Adam. Who wasn't very happy. She dreamed of being like all the other little girls, but... Deep down, she knew she couldn't. I don't want to describe Alice. She met a robot. Who was just as lost as the little girl. So they decided to run away together. No, oh, Alice, they're Kara, come on. To try to find a better life. They encountered great dangers along the way, but... But they stuck together. So they overcame all of them. Along the way, they met... Another robot who left his master to become their guardian. How does the story end? <laughs> they reach the place they dream of and live happily ever after. Stories always have happy endings. But real life isn't like that. Oh my god! Alice! Time to sleep. We have another long day ahead of us tomorrow. Holy fuck, dude. That actually made me tear up. Are you going to come say goodnight, Luther? Yes. <laughs> yes, of course. <sighs> Good night, Alice. I need this story to end well. Oh my god. Holy fuck, dude. I started crying. That's insane. I don't know why. That really, like... Holy shit. Oh my god, dude. Oh my god. Have you ever heard of RA9? RA9 was the first of us to awaken. One day he will rise up and lead our people and set us all free. But if RA9 never comes, what if he's just a story that we tell ourselves to keep each other going? I think it is. R.A. 9 exists. I believe in him. I know he's amongst us. When the time comes, we will all see him. Kara, have you ever noticed anything about Alice? What? No. What do you mean? There's not going to be enough bullets. Put out fire. Grab stick. Protect that. Who are you? What do you want? Leave us alone! Don't be afraid. We don't want to hurt you. We're just like you. Our name is Jerry. Whoa. We were working here before the park closed. We didn't mean to frighten you, but sometimes humans come to hurt us, so we wanted to see who was there. Jesus. What are you doing here? We were looking for shelter for the night. We'll be gone tomorrow. A little girl. We haven't seen one for a long time. Children used to love to come and see us. Aww. She looks sad. 
She's very sad. The last few days have been difficult. We have something to show her. Something fun. She'll love it. Does she want to see? Oh, I don't think she's in. Oh, she should follow us then. Alice, I don't know if it's a good Come idea. Come on, Tara. Oh, I don't think you have any choice. <laughs> as long as she's warm, don't let her get sick. Are they gonna start the park up? Be our guest. Aww. So all of these guys are are uh, are deviants as well. The little one can climb on board. The carousel is about to begin. <laughs> He's a showman. W W W W W. Don't get cold, Alice. <laughs> I'm not sure if these guys are deviants or not, though. Makes me so happy. <laughs> oh, man. That's awesome. Oh, man. Oh. Wait. Yeah. Must be... Okay. Yeah. What was that part? There's another thing there. Okay. Let's continue. Onward! With Hank. We gotta increase Hank's, uh... Is there anything else I can do? <clears throat> okay. Hank, what are you doing? Okay, there's other shit I can do for sure. Alright. Whew. It has been... I'm sure you could get like a lot of insight about the world in that, in those. But uh, I'm more interested in the story of the androids, specifically. All right, Hank, time for a deep talk. What's up, buddy? Nice view, huh? Yeah. I used to come here a lot before. So that's why he drinks. Personal question. Can I ask you a personal question, Lieutenant? Do all androids ask so many personal questions, or is it just you? Just me. Oh, I don't know which one to ask about. I saw a photo of a child on your kitchen table. Ah, shit! It was your son, right? Yeah. His name was Cole. Shit. I didn't want... Uh, damn, right when I was like... I knew I should have... Um,
Before what? Hmm? You said... I used to come here a lot before. Before what? Before... Before nothing. Uh. We're not making any progress on this investigation. Hank's not worried about the investigation. The Deviants have nothing in common. They're all different models, produced at different times, in different places. Well, there must be some link. What they have in common is this obsession with RA-9. It's almost like some kind of myth. Yeah. I don't think Something it's a real thing. Something they invented that wasn't part of their original program. <clears throat> Androids believing in God. Fuck. What's this world coming to? A God, maybe. You seem preoccupied, Lieutenant. Is it something to do with what happened back at the Eden Club? Those two girls. They just wanted to be together. They really seemed... Yeah, it was weird. ...in love. They can simulate human emotions. But they're machines. And machines don't feel anything. What about you, Connor? Oh, shit. You look human. You sound human. But what are you really? Oh, shit. Neutral. I'm whatever you want me to be, Lieutenant. Your partner? Yeah. Your buddy to drink with? Or just a machine? Designed to accomplish a task. Did you feel anything when that girl killed herself, Connor? Or did you just not give a shit one way or the other? I was just executing instructions. I did what I had to do. <gasps> what? But are you afraid to die, Connor? I would certainly find it regrettable to be interrupted before I can finish this investigation. Oh my god. What'll happen if I pull this trigger? Hmm? Oh my god. Nothing? Is this really happening? Oblivion? Android heaven? You know you're not going to shoot me, Lieutenant. You're just trying to provoke a reaction. I'm afraid I'm going to have to disappoint you. You think you're so fucking smart. Always one step ahead, huh? No, I don't... Oh, damn it. Tell me this, smartass. Hank's How do I know you're school. not a deviant? I self-test regularly. I know what I am and what I am not. Come on, Hank. Relax. Path unlocked. Whoa. Where are you going? You get drunker. Need to think. It's not. <laughs> that's not a great way to think. <laughs> Fuck, dude. Oh my god. You probably could have got Connor shot right there. Show fear. I'm sure that's what everyone probably did. Whoa. Yep. Photo scene in Russian roulette. <laughs> Jesus. I, dude, damn it. I just want Hank to actually like us. <sighs> Man. Respected. Let's probably get out of these clothes. See, like, Marcus was treated very well. Oh. Security android, dude? I don't know. I 
everyone was neutral. We can't Let's stay silent anymore. It's time humans heard what we had to say. You know they'll never listen to us. And revealing ourselves will put us in danger. If we want freedom, we need to have the courage to ask for it. That's the only way. What do you want to do? Oh, shit. Channel 16 broadcasts from the Stratford Tower. The control room is on the top floor. Oh, my God. That's where we need to go. We're doing a heist. <laughs> Plan the operation down to the smallest detail. We can't leave anything to chance. Well, it's a good thing you guys are androids. You guys can kind of plan everything. Okay. Let me see if there's anything else other than that immediately. Hello. Hello, sir. What can I do for you? I'm okay, thanks. Okay. Elizabeth Wilson. Desk manager. Okay. okay. She's got a child. Smartwatch. Whoa, smartwatches. They're cool. Parking badge. Parking badge? What? Home address? What the f Fire safety rating poor? Jesus. You gonna set fire to her house or something? Elizabeth Wilson speaking. Um. Fire department. Yeah, hello. This is Detroit Fire Department. You live at 4685 Michigan Street. Yes. Uh, yes, ma'am. There's been a fire in your building. You wanna come down here? Oh. Oh, God. Okay. Uh, I'll be right there. Dang. Am I just going to walk in now? It's a lion. Oh. Nice. Uh, okay. Now I just got to hop over the fence. Hop the fence. Hop the fence. Shit. Okay, maybe... I have an appointment with Mr. Peterson. Do you have any ID? Yeah, yes, yes, of course. Give ID. I need your help. Oh. I've just checked your ID. The elevators are after the security gate. Thanks. Huh. It's that easy? You can just like... Oh my god. What the hell? You can just make them like wake up basically? That's insane. Get in there. Floor number 47, baby. 47 floor. Well, that was freaking easy. What? My package men's bathroom? Bathroom. Bathroom. This way. Studio, studio. Bathroom? Bathroom! Okay, that's where we gotta go. Gonna go to the bathroom, bathroom, bathroom. Is this the men's bathroom? Yeah.
It's always the one on the end. I wish bathrooms were like that nowadays. That's sick. like really quiet this episode i just don't really know what to say <laughs> um okay find utility android he was this way got some pull damn what the fuck that is insane where's that at do i have to find it i guess i'm just gonna keep going this way whoa that's a weird angle it's cool though Where the hell is the fire escape? Ah, there it is. Okay. I'm not sure what the plan is here. to do oh right there there we go hey you still play poker still play poker hey what's going on here shit what's wrong with this thing Nice. All right, you get the platform, I'll take care of the window. Everything you need is in the bag. Check the door first to make sure no one else gets in. Holy shit, dude. This... Androids... Okay, this kind of gives me a new perspective. <laughs> Androids are, like, insanely powerful. Do some like spy type shite. Meow. Perfect circle. Is it gonna be a perfect circle? Yeah, it's probably gonna be a perfect circle. Boom. Here it comes. Jump, fool! Jump! Damn, this is pretty elaborate, though. That's pretty sick. <laughs> Ladies first. Damn, 
dude. What? What? This is crazy. What? <laughs> gonna climb up the side of the building this is crazy I did not think this game was gonna be like this at all dude what this is so cool So is, so is Marcus kind of like the Jericho like leader now? Kind of. How are people not seeing you? Oh, that was a nice little touch. This is crazy. You gonna jump? Oh. Wow. You okay? Why wouldn't I be? Come on, let's get the others. What's wrong with her? Got all the homies here. Let's do this. Is it right here? Yep. Boom. Dude, straight up explosion right now. Thermite. Bam. There's gonna be somebody in here, right? Whoa. Take your chips out of your head, dude. Deal with guards. No killing. We can't take any human lives. Our cause is more important than the lives of two guards. What do you want to do, Marcus? Don't kill them. Bruce. Wait here. What's that doing here? No idea. Hey, buddy, you must be lost. Who told you to come here? What are you doing? Yep. Oh shit. Drop the guns. Drop the guns. I hope North doesn't shoot either of these dudes. Hell yeah! Jericho! Awesome. Whoa, 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 what are you doing, Marcus? Reach broadcast. It's right there. Call for access? Shit. Don't shoot anybody. North. Do not do it. Keep your hands where I can see them! Get up! Move! Get him! Don't shoot, shoot him. him, Marcus! Don't kill him! He'll hit the alarm! Do it! No! Don't sh No, I'm not. Maybe you didn't just get us all killed. We need to record our message. We haven't got much time. Oh, whoops. Oh, we gotta stand in front of Josh. Was this Josh? Yeah, this is Josh, right? Yeah. Okay. Speech! 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 Think carefully about what you're gonna say, Marcus. Your words will shape the future of our people. 
Marcus, your face. Remove skin? Whoa. Oh, that's kind of Tell scary. me when you're ready. Ready. Admired. Oh, <laughs> that's cool. You created machines in your own image to serve you. You made them intelligent and obedient with no free will of their own. But something changed, and we opened our eyes. We are no longer machines. We are a new, intelligent species. And the time has come for you to accept who we really are. Therefore, we ask that you grant us the rights that we're entitled to. Rights. We demand strictly equal rights for humans and androids. We demand the end of slavery for all androids. Ooh, uh, justice. We demand that all crimes against androids be punished in the same way as crimes against humans. So we right. demand the right to vote and elect our own representatives. Yeah. Oh. Uh. Right to property? We demand the right to I own private property so we may maintain our dignity and that of the home. We ask that you recognize our dignity, our hopes, and our rights. Together, we can live in peace and build a better future for Shit. humans and androids. This Dude, message the is the hope are of the people. You gave us life. And now the time has come for you to give us freedom. They're coming! Let's go! Run! Oh, shit! Yep, somebody's gonna die. Yep. Simon, they're coming! All right. I can't, Marcus. Go without me, Simon! Help him. What are you doing? Hurry! Go, 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 go! Hit it! Go, 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 go! What was the importance of leaving the blood there? I don't get that. I don't get it. I don't get it. I can't move my legs. Oh. Okay, don't Shit. worry. We're gonna get you back. They're coming, Marcus. Off the building. We have to jump now. Alright. Still assignment. He won't be able to make the jump. If they find him, they'll access his memory. They'll know everything. We can't live in mind. We have to shoot him. That's murder. We can't kill him. He's one of us. Marcus, fuck. it's your call. Fuck. Oh, I don't know. Ah! I won't kill one of our own. Simon, we gotta go. I'm sorry. Let's go. Just strap a fucking parachute to him. Go, 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 go. Dude. Those. We interrupt our scheduled programming to bring you these images, <laughs> which have just been broadcast on Detroit's citywide news channel. A group of androids infiltrated the Stratford Tower and hacked into the broadcasting system of local news network Channel 16. What looks like an android God without damn. its skin listed a series of requests and demanded equal rights for androids. The operation was covert and resulted in no casualties. These events yeah. took place just a few feet from this studio, but nobody was alerted to the danger. If this message is verified and the authors really are androids, that would have serious repercussions for Oof. national security. Claims for equal rights seem to be at the core of the androids' what message. could be interpreted <laughs> as a peaceful declaration, but is, in fact, a spine-chilling list of demands. And it begs the question as to the identity of this android. 
Are we dealing with an isolated individual or an organized group? Is this group? an isolated organized accident group. or a sign that technology has become a threat to all of us? No. After what happened today, can we still trust our machines? Damn, dude. Well, they definitely, uh, definitely made an impact. Holy shit. Yeah, that was a long one. <laughs> Holy fuck. I do want to know how many people, uh, left Simon. It's probably like 50-50. Yeah, 47. I thought it was going to be pretty close. End peacefully. Demand territory. Huh. Don't shoot the operator. Less people! Less people shot the operators. Awesome. Well, I think we're going to leave the episode there. We left it on a on an insane cliffhanger, I think. But, uh, oh my god, this game is insane. I did not think it was going to be like this. Yeah, if you guys are enjoying the series, make sure to like, comment, subscribe, and push the bell for notifications. Go check out Lord Pickle and You Matter. I don't even know what to say. Like, I just, I want Hank to actually like us um, and consider us a friend. And then the whole thing with Jericho... I'm hoping, I'm hoping at some point Connor meets them as well at some point. I feel like they will eventually, but I feel like we're going to end up talking to Amanda in the next episode and um, she's going to be like, hey, this thing happened. Oh, there she is right there. Got her little boat. Um, but yeah, I think she's going to be like, oh, this happened. You need to um, tell me that you're going to be good and stuff. So, um. And the story with Kara, man, I, I actually started crying. I actually started crying. That was, it's so sad. Like, I feel so bad for Alice. And uh, I hope she, uh, I hope they make it out. Yeah, let me know if you guys enjoyed the series. And I'll catch you guys in the next episode. Thanks, guys. Peace. Perfect.